Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading here to see what we can best do with the energies of the coming week and the blessings we can receive from them. The first card is Mystic of Fire, Effervescence. The second card is Three of Fire, Growth. The third card is Major 21, Wholeness. The fourth card is Nurturer of Water, Harmony. And the fifth card is Major 11, Strength. This is really a nice looking week here. We're getting some good ones. So we begin this, this week with Effervescence. And effervescence is the energy that we leave behind us as we move through life. It's what spreads out around us as we're interacting with people and going about our days. This is that wonderful, light, magical, inviting energy that makes other people feel good when they encounter it and that lifts our own spirits too. So we're beginning the week in that just wonderful lightness of our being and leaving a trail of that everywhere that we go. And from there, we're moving into growth. This is a lovely, gentle growth because we're coming into it from this place of effervescence. This is a joyful growth that we step into. And when we move through that growth at the middle of the week, we're standing in wholeness. Now this tells me that we're putting some pieces together for ourselves that really increase our ability to synthesize our lives, our ability to be in all of our being, as opposed to just being partially here. From wholeness, we move into harmony, which of course is the outflow of wholeness. And from that harmony at the end of the week, we're in our strength. Now this strength is personal power. This is that gentle, centered, I know how to do what needs to happen in my life kind of strength. This isn't pushing out with force into the world. This is gently holding your place in the world and knowing that you can do whatever you need to. So in summary for the week, begin with all your sparkle and joy and soak it up and spread it out to others. Use that wonderful energy to joyfully step into some growth that you've been wanting to do. And let that growth come into the wholeness that really brings you into a place in your life where you can do everything that's needed, everything that's desired. Enjoy the harmony that naturally comes from that. It's not too good to be true. It's really that harmonious. And as you finish the week, recognize the incredible amount of personal power that you truly have simply because you're a human being and you know how to come to your center. Have a beautiful week this week. Mm -hmm.